वेलकम टू दी सेशन इन दिस सेशन वी डिस्कस दी फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन विच से फाइंड दी पॉइंट ऑन दी कर्व वाई इक्वल टू एक्स क्यू एट विच दी स्लोप ऑफ दी टेंजेंट इज इक्वल टू दी वाई कॉर्डिनेट ऑफ दी पॉइंट लेट्स नॉट प्रोसीड विद दी सोल्यूशन द गिवन कर्व इज वाई इक्वल टू एक्स क्यू लेट दिस बी इक्वेशन वन We have to find the points on this curve at which the slope of the tangent is equal to the y coordinate of the point. For this, we suppose let the required point be x1, y1. That is, x coordinate is x1 and y coordinate is y1. Now, the point x1, y1 lies on the curve. Given by equation one, therefore, this means we have y one is equal to x one cube. Let this be equation two. Next, differentiating equation one with respect to x, we get. dy by dx is equal to 3x square now dy by dx at the point x1 y1 is equal to 3 x1 square now this dy by dx at the point x1 y1 is the slope of the tangent at the point x1 y1 now as in the question it's given that the slope of the tangent at that point on the curve is equal to the y coordinate of the point so according to the question Would be equal to the y coordinate of the point, which is y1. Let this be equation three. Now, from equation two, we have y1 equal to x1 cube. So, from the equations two and three, that is. these two equations we have 3x1 square is equal to x1 cube which means x1 cube minus 3x1 square is equal to 0 or you can say x1 square into x1 minus 3 the whole is equal to 0 which means that either x1 square equal to 0 Or x1 minus 3 is equal to zero. That is, we have x1 equal to zero or x1 equal to three. So we now get two values for x1, either zero or three. Now putting x1 equal to zero in equation two, we have y1 equal to zero. Therefore, we say For x1 equal to zero, we get y1 equal to zero. Next, putting x1 equal to three in equation two, we get y1 equal to three q. That is twenty seven. Therefore, we say for x1 equal to three, we get y1 equal to 27 here we have two set of points 0 0 and 3 27 hence the required points are 0 0 and 3 27 So this is our final answer. This completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution of this question.